I'm taking a quick break from making uh, videos about these, why you shouldn't stick them in your mouth, scrapping microwaves, and how much copper I'm going to get from 11 microwaves. Uh, I'm taking a break from that just to mention something about YouTube copyright, which I found out. Uh, my other fellow scrap YouTubers may well know this already, it's just sort of like happened to me recently. Um, copyright claims for music. Now, I posted a video recently which had me playing bass along with. Um, some music I had to play in a band so there was Robbie Williams and Blondie and Doobie Brothers and stuff so I expected a copyright claim for that um, what I've got is copyright claims for free music which I've been using in my videos since pretty early on So the copyright claims mean that everyone can see my videos and they're still public and it's not going to restrict anyone seeing them. But um, I'm not monetized, but if I was, it would mean that I wouldn't get any money from the videos because they're snippets of, of apparently copyrighted material. The music I've used, the reggae beat you might have seen in lots of my videos, is from a beat maker called Unknown Instrumentals. Um, he makes free for profit beats and releases them on YouTube and you can go to a site that he's registered for and download them. I like reggae, I like his track Rastafari, um, so I've used that and it's happened in lots of my videos that when I'm taking apart something I'll have that in the background and then do voiceover with it. Um, I've got copyright claim, but not from unknown instrumentals. What happens is um, uh, a company will um, use the beat, claim they've got copyright ownership of it, and then do copyright claims trying to get any money they can from any videos that use this beat despite the fact they know it's a free to use beat they know people will have used it because it was free to use they claim to have ownership of it and they try and make as much money doing the copyright claims as they can i've disputed these copyright claims i've explained to youtube that they're bogus claims and it's just a quick money scheme and there are other videos on youtube about this but um yeah uh youtube have upheld it saying that they own the copyright despite the fact that they are given the copyright of the same piece of music to three different companies. Um, so uh, yeah, it's upsetting for me because I probably won't be able to use that because if I ever do get monetized it would mean I'd be giving these people money and even though it would be fractions of a penny, they don't deserve it. Um, if Unknown Instrumentals wanted to claim copyright, if he changed his mind about it being a free beat, I'd be completely fine with that. It's his work, it's his IP, he made it. Um, but um, yeah it's just a bit scummy and a bit annoying and it, I think that um, the reggae beat made my videos I think it gave my videos a look and slightly different to other people's whether people like that or not I don't know but um, yeah it's a bit disheartening that I won't be able to do that anymore or I'll have to find another beat to use and even so if I use another free, to, free, to, free for profit beat who's to say these people won't register it again and then you know try and make money off of that so other than paying to get my own beat made because although i play bass i don't really know anything about um programming um yeah i don't know what i can do so it may just mean a change in my videos that that beat is not used thus far the little bit of the rastafari that I use at the beginning and end of my videos for the sort of intro and outros those haven't been flagged up it's only when it's been in the body of the song it hasn't happened every time in every video i've used it in but yeah, there's three different people claiming to own, this, own the same um, piece of music and um, YouTube held it, which is unfortunate. But you should be aware, so if you're going to use a free to use beat, these uh, scumbags might try, might try and claim money from it. Cheers. I'm aware that I've used the beat in the intro and outro again. Why? Because fuck them, that's why. Suspend your sentence.